Hello. 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 Usually, after coming back from my daughter's school, I make myself some tea and sometimes two cups and the other cup I drink it whilst I am crawled into bed. But today I cannot do that because it's the last day of school and my daughter is coming out at 10 o'clock. The school closes at 10 o'clock today. So, yeah. I'm gonna have something to eat, wash dishes, and just sweep all the floors. I did clean yesterday. Uh, the whole house swept and mopped the floors, and I'm not gonna do that on this day. I'm just gonna sweep everything and then just do the dishes before I leave. And as I mentioned last night, we had um, what breakfast dinner and i have here like bread from last night which has ham inside and then i'm going to, going to add um, a bit of acha so i must mention that when i came when i first came to bomalanga mm -hmm. to start off my career in construction i had no idea what this is for us people who come from the western cape and eastern cape acha is a spice <laughs> so this one is garlic acha by the way and we buy it at spa and it just freaked me out the amount of oil of oil that is used to submerge the the, the acha the actual acha and the the mango peels also just freaked me out and i didn't like it at first i actually don't really like it and the only way for me to eat it is if it's in food like maybe pap something like that and all on bread as i'm doing now and then i'm going to toast the bread because the oil and the mango peels is still freak me out a bit but um, the taste is not so bad and i do prefer acha that is bought from the store or from someone that i trust i really don't like food that is you know cooked or prepared at home and then somebody just you know sells it i just don't trust that i do eat street food if i see that a person has fire there and a pot so that i can see that they are cooking it in front of me so uh anyway that's what i'm doing now i'm just gonna prepare this before i do um, before i do dishes just to eat and then now what i'm gonna do whilst the bread is toasting is to just to prepare the prep my dishes before did you guys see that sorry this is something that i really really dislike i don't like it and i always tell people if you want me to wash your cups you better take out what is so difficult about taking out a tea bag and just draining it out and putting it in the bin before you put your cup in the sink so i really hate this and sometimes what i do is that i don't wash those cups i put them aside until a person washes their own cup and actually takes out the tea bag because really why 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 are you leaving it in there it's so it just is it is disgusting just take out your tea bag and put the cup in the sink please anyway before i rudely interrupted myself i am just prepping the sink with the dishes that i'm gonna wash and also whilst the water is boiling because i'm boiling the water for my tea and for these dishes as well and then 
I'm going to go and have something to eat and then I'll come back and do the rest of these dishes. We are also uh, going for my daughter's 12th year injection today as well after school. I thought I'll take the opportunity when she comes out of school or home early to go and um, to the clinic basically for her 12th year immunization. And yeah, that's what we're going to do after school as well. We'll be going to the clinic.
We are done. Yeah, mom. Huh? It's very hurt. Just the name Bronco played the YouTube mm. in, in, in. Okay, so you didn't hurt mm -hmm. the injection? No, it's just one. Okay. <laughs> Tiny prick. Okay. It didn't hurt. I felt like she didn't even. Now I am adding the last bit of my laundry, which is my daughter's school wear. Uh, the one she was wearing today at school and oh, this is the last time i'm gonna be washing these things for the next three weeks they will just be tucked away i don't want to see any uniform <laughs> for the next three weeks until uh the schools open so yeah this uh just tucking in the laundry into the water and then i'm gonna let this spin for 15 minutes and then I'm gonna let it spin again for the next for 15 minutes again because it only takes 15 minutes for the first load and then you can clock it up again one to add the minutes which is what I'm going to do basically I'm gonna wash these for the next 30 minutes before I drain the water and then put in the water for rinsing and on our way from from the clinic we stopped by at the butchery and i bought this minced meat one is savory this one over here and the other one is just super normal or you just use standard um, minced meat this one is all the spices the reason why i bought the second one is just the other one the savory one likes to be rich sometimes so i like to mix this too we're gonna have it for lunch today uh with some rice so this is the time currently whilst the clothes in the wash yeah that is the time basically
laundry is done and i am just hanging everything on the line and i think this was a very productive morning i did everything i wanted to do today that i, I planned to do and taking my daughter to the clinic i swept the whole house and i did the dishes and i did the laundry and now after i'm done hanging these clothes i'm going to make lunch for us and that's it thank you so much for watching this video i hope you got some motivation and i'll see you in another one bye guys <laughs>